Latitude. I am Pinstar, and this is City Skyline Strategy and Tactics, Episode 32. So in our last episode, we uh, uh, started fleshing out our new double tree zone here, getting the office half uh, built up here. Uh, just like the Weeping Willow zone, I am. Uh, it's designed to be modular, so it did. You don't have to make the one half of your double tree zone be an office uh, section. That just happened to be what our city needs right now. And this bottom half here is probably going to be residentials. We were just building up the cash and building up the demand. Um, and uh, that will really start testing the limits of the zone proper. So I think without further ado, let's uh, do that, shall we? Uh, so we already uh, plopped our extra police station here, and I should have enough for the other accoutrement. Uh, now there is already coverage here um, for... Um, Actually, you know what? Let's do an experiment. I'm gonna do an experiment. I'm gonna see. I'm gonna. I'm gonna leave off the medical clinic here. Um, not gonna. Not gonna experiment with the fire station. I am going to give them the extra fire station. Um, and but yeah, let's leave off the medical clinic. See how everyone develops, and then plop it down and see if I get uh, any prices writing. Because if I get prices writing, that means you need that second zone to get full uh, service effectiveness. Uh, now, the other thing we want here is uh, going to be an elementary school, actually, two elementary schools to cover a zone of this magnitude. Um, and yeah, if we, yeah, we build you up here at the top. And up here at the top, and a high school up here at the tippy top. Now I am not going to cover this area with a college, uh, or rather a university, um, because it's just one thing. But what I might do is I might do a double tree zone with it being residential, residential, and then uh, make this area a little wider and stick a university right there in the middle, along with the train station. Um, a lot, a lot of, a lot of, a lot of fun things you can do right here in the middle, and you don't have to make it as narrow as I did. In fact, I probably wish I made it a little bit wider. Um, but it, 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 if there's nothing else, you can make it commercial zones because they're certainly going to get plenty of freaking traffic. All right, so let's get it. And yep, we're going to stay true to our uh, word here and stick it with. Uh, Stick with uh, dense residential here. We want to test the limits of our zone. Um, I think we, yeah, we already uh, we already uh, linked you up um, our metro station, so that should be taken care of. Oh, we need uh, we need our uh, we need our uh, Zen gardens. Cannot forget those. There we go. Um, part of me, actually, I might experiment um, and uh, akin to that. Uh, wait for everything to basically level off to the highest level it's naturally going to get, and then do another pair here and see if that pushes it even further, or if that's just going to be redundant. Um, all right. Oh yeah, and uh, water. They're probably going to want water. Actually, yeah, we're going to need more. We're going to need more just raw capacity for water and sewage. So why don't I lay the pipe work here and then go add to my network. More drinkage, more poopage. Easy come, easy go. And I've already kind of committed to polluting this section of the river, so I'm not going to bother with water treatment plants. Um, yeah, <laughs> but I thought about it earlier, maybe, but at this point, nah, let them swim in poo, or float on poo. Yeah, the power should spread through here pretty easily. We just need one, yeah, there we go. And, oh yeah, let's, um, just to give them the greatest benefit here. Let's give them high-tech housing. Uh, 
All right, you guys are. Oh, you're right. You guys, yep. All level two. Um, do we have any level anyone going up to uh, level three? You know, they want to go to level three, and I figure I have a feeling they'd be level three already if we weren't on hard mode, uh, which is fine. I'm I I can accept a two um, if that is the way it's gonna go. Yeah, yeah. Well, commercial demand's gonna creep up, so you guys should uh, you guys should start unabandoning yourselves pretty soon. I've already put enough commercial nooks and crannies around here, and yeah, you, these this this whole area is nice and fleshed out. You know what? Uh, just for experimentation's sake, let's 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 try it with. Um, with these. So yes, we're gonna have traffic lights. We're gonna have to deal with traffic lights. Actually, since they're touching this road up here, I have an idea. Oh yeah, you can you can stay against that road, but everyone who's touching this central road is going to be commercial. Just to give commercial a little bit more presence here. Actually, not with the residentials because that's going to create that's going to expand the noise profile. You guys can go back to being that. But you guys, you guys don't care so much about the noise. So you guys can get a... You, we can dip commercial into you guys a little bit. Because you're going to be having the customers anyway. What the heck is going on here? from the other direction. There. Uh, well, we'll see if we'll see if people can walk up that. They should. It might just be a little graphical hiccup. Oh yeah, I also need to pay attention to here to see if people can come out this back or go into the back. If not, that may be problematic. Because we want people to be able to use this rear exit. You're leveling up nice and quick. The media center. All right, we got not enough educated workers. Huh. Are my universities maxed out? Where are my universities? Huh. Maybe I will have to splurge for one here. Yeah, it also just might be a, a surge in demand for them. There's all these all these people moving in here. Are, uh, yeah, they're all young adults. They're all actually they're all just basic educated. That's a lot of just basic educated. Interesting. Um, do we have uh, someone who? Do we have enough high schools? Let me check my high school uh, capacity here. Not enough high schools. Where, um, who is overburdened? You are, you're full. You are full. 
Hmm. Yeah, we might be a. We might be a, high schools might be our our uh, bottleneck actually. If, uh, Wait, hang on. Do you guys not have any, um... You have an elementary school, but you don't have a high school. Let's get you guys a high school. Does that uh, cover you enough? Not really. Yeah, it's got to find a good spot for it. Now, that might not. That might be why I didn't draw, give them a high school in the first place. Well, we have a new high school up here, so we're going to get some more high school educated workers over here. That should be good enough. And yeah, we'll see how the traffic shakes out before I decide whether or not to hook this area up with... Uh, um, buses or not. But again, the zone is still young, so it's hard to pass judgments on it yet. The train gets in. I don't know. I don't know if that rear building is gonna is, is working as intended. Might not, which is which would be really unfortunate. But actually, well, as a as a temporary measure, then there. All right, now they can get on through the back. There. All right, so they can't get off on that main building, but the. Uh, little patch over there should uh, should serve them nicely. Crematorium, hearse is in use, 7 of 7. I think we're dealing with a death wave, probably. Not a citywide one, though. Alright, All right, you guys keep going here. Actually, you know what? Just to get a little more cash out of you. Um, um, tax, raise tax on high density commercial. Because you guys, you, these commercial zones, you guys are getting Boku bucks from, uh, from, from customers. You can afford, you can afford it. So you're going to get the tax. Yo. This is like premium strip right here. These poor businesses, they're like, we just need somebody to graduate, please. Somebody graduate college. Yeah, we're just waiting for demand trickling in here. Yeah, we must be in mid-death wave. We've, we've built up a whole new residential section, yet our population is down. That would be a death wave from our uh, older generation here. Also, um, yeah, we're just barely covered by garbage. That is one thing that this uh, double tree zone is not self-contained with, is it does not do its own garbage, unless you have a, an industry uh, part of it um, that, can, that doesn't care about the pollution. Um, but, you know, you hook, them up, hook, hook up uh, that with uh, um, some uh, highway networks and people won't mind so much.
Yeah, I'm glad I bought this bigger plot because these things are freaking huge. I don't know how many of these I'm going to be able to squeeze in. I might, I might do a sideways one here and just reroute the highways up here just so they're not in the way. Or actually make them part of it. Ooh, that could be dangerous. That could be very dangerous. Making making one of these on other sides of this highway? That could be that could get ugly. That could get really, really ugly. So yeah, maybe not so much. Alright, let's see how our numbers are doing here. Uh, primarily adults um, and young adults, um, young population. Um, yeah, you guys are still uh, still waiting to level up here. It's our train station. 134 passengers. Look at that. That now that is some train usage. No, I already looked at how much I want. You 624. Look at that mass transit use, ladies and gentlemen. That is what I am freaking talking about. So much mass, per no, so much mass transit. Mass transit equals very yes. And thousand already maxed out. Not quite maxed out. Not quite maxed out. But you guys are. Kim, you guys are at max capacity here. We should do like specific budgets for specific schools. Like just just boost the high school budgets, but leave uh, elementary schools and whatnot alone. Mm. All right, yeah, we're just waiting for de demand before you guys continue going up. This area is a hot mess. Yeah, it's a hot mess. It is a boiling hot mess. Boiling hot mess. All right. Continuing on. Hey, our population's back to uh, to full here. Well, full positive, I should say. All right, now what are you, Vicia? You're, what do you want? Educate more citizens. Okay, so so it's actually education. So I'm not gonna I'm not gonna do any of my experimental uh, adjustments here um, based on this because if education is uh, is is uh, lagging behind a little bit, then that might be our issue. I mean, it doesn't help that we have this this uh, Dumbleton zone here, but again, I want I want a patch of uneducated workers to work some of the unwanted jobs, because all this low density commercial over here this, that's all uneducated workers too. They're having the same problems filling the jobs here. So yeah, I am sticking to that, but we do want to educate these areas. All right, moving up, moving up, moving up. Need residents. Oh, that's just a brand new one. Never mind. Let's just look at our grand numbers here. Yeah, train usage is uh, up quite health healthily. And look at this, traffic is running smoothly. I and mean, we got ourselves a full boat here. Um, and it doesn't look like there's anything really nasty further down the low. Oh boy, death wave, death wave, death wave, death wave. Max out healthcare budget to get more of them hearses out. I guess that's something else I could stick in here in the middle is a graveyard. If I made this a little wider, I can't stick it in here, but future zones might uh, might be widened and have a graveyard stuck in there just for extra hearse capacity. Uh, since those don't pollute, heck, if you uh, you do landfills, if uh, if it was a double industrial zone, 
I might do a double industrial zone. That would be fun. That would be fun to see if I can get the logistics to work on that. And you know what? I think, I think up here, I, this up here is going to be my double industrial zone. Just to sort of, it, it's, you know, it's all going to be part of King's Row. King's Row is just going to be like all dirty industry all the time with a double. Even though it's a different section, it's going to get double industrial. Absolutely. I'll do something with this highway here to make it fit. And then maybe do maybe, oh heck, maybe do a, a double residential right here. Um, right uh, right next to it and then have uh, have sort of like a regional train line go through here so you guys can get up to the double industrial um, and then you know if we can fit it uh, maybe uh, like a commercial um, oh actually no this we could do another uh, Dumbleton uh, another uh, ore extractor um, plus uneducated uh, worker zone over here to tap into the ore That uh, that is a distinct possibility, but yeah, this is definitely we're definitely riding out a huge death wave. Um, are there any graveyards that are currently not accepting people? Because they we need them. You're emptying. You need to stop emptying and start accepting people. It's a death wave. We'll we'll empty you again later. Pretty happy with how this is uh, starting to turn out. Um, level three, educate more citizens. All right, you know what? Darn it! I'm gonna just bite the bullet and just buy the freaking university. You guys obviously want it, and I've been kind of, I've been kind of skimpy with them. Can't fit it in here though. Well, the space already occupied. It's just, it's a shame because it's a really, really good spot for it. But, yeah, I guess I'll put it up here. Actually, let's put it on this side. Oh, there. This should start enrolling people very quickly. I'm getting a little prices riding there. Yeah, especially since we're going, since we're across from the offices, and the offices really, really want educated people, as well as, well as the higher level um, commercial zones. They want the higher educated people as well. So yeah, let's just let's uh, I'll I'll bite the bullet on that one. Boy, you'd have thought I'd have hit 50k with uh, with this zone developing. All right, let's do some uh, let's do some in depth. Uh... How many people got on this train? 57, not too shabby. Uh, 153. All right, let's. Uh... Yeah, no one's spitting out the back here. Let's follow somebody. Let's follow someone. Highly educated senior. Well, you're slow. I'm not going to follow senior. Sorry. Yeah, let's follow you. Alright, so James Lee just got himself onto that. Now he's on... Uh, now he's getting on the train. Oh, he just teleported on the... Uh, Guess he missed his train. Sorry, dude. But I just want to see where somebody might go. So you work at the Chestnut Residence, or you live at the Chestnut Residence. You work at the Cargo Harbor. Interesting. So let's find out where you go. Yeah, I know. You're going to have to. You just missed the train. Okay. You're getting on the train. Let's follow you. This is one of my favorite parts of this game. Just just following people. 
Wow, look at the lean on those trucks. Alright, we're sneaking our way around here. Across the uh, highway. Hi there, Mr. Crane. And at our destination. Alright, so he is in disembarked. Let's see where he goes. Alright, got spat out the front. Running across the street. Just gonna hoof it. Might hoof it. Run, Forrest, run! Where's he going? Yeah, he's just gonna walk there. Alright, no need to follow him there. But I'd say it's a that's a pretty good run distance uh, for him to uh, go on foot. All right, look at this. Look at this. I do say um, so far it's looking pretty successful. Um, and yeah, the traffic here not so nightmarish, just because of how many people are taking mass transit. I mean, people are loving this train station, and people are absolutely lo holy crap! 980, 84 people are using this this one metro station. This one metro station. How how many uh, users? Yeah, 51. So yeah, these these are feeders. All right. Yeah, I didn't really don't feel compelled. To get a bus network going in here, because I don't want people to use uh, to use buses when they could be walking and using metro stations instead. The only thing I can think of that might be a good uh, place for a bus, but again, there's no real good U-turn, is um, is this zone. But the U-turn is like the bus goes on here and then it has to go through this nightmare. And uh, I don't want to send buses through that central uh, central area, so I'm not. Ooh, some prices riding here. Upgrade, upgrade, upgrade. Good. That is what I'm talking about. All right, now you guys, what do you want? More services. You guys want more services. That is the battle cry. All right. Let us try to see if these count as services or not. Let us try a, uh, a, a mirrored uh, mirrored uh, zone here. Because these things aren't too expensive. See if we get any prices writing in our office complex. No. Well, a little bit. We're looking for threes. That's a two. That's a two. That's a two. That's also a two. They want threes. And they want more services. All right, maybe they do want uh, a bus route. That might that might be what they're looking for. All right, here's what we're gonna do. We're gonna do a bus route, and we're gonna do it right here by uh, by our. Uh, Actually, yeah, we're not gonna we're not going to do it here. We're gonna do it. Uh, see, that's the thing. It's like everything is so centralized. It'd just be really, really good. Actually, we could do an outer loop bus bus line, like sort of a figure eight thing. Why not? Let's let's try it. So we put you here. Put 
A little silly, but not as silly as it could be. There, an outer loop. Kind of ugly, but we'll see how it does. Uh, in our next episode, it'll take a while for those buses that we ordered to make their way down here. Um, but, oh, actually, nope, nope, level twos. Well, we'll see if the residentials respond to the double, uh, yeah, because you're already level four. What do you want? Increased land value. And you guys are purple here, but, hey, Metropolis! Let's pretend that, that that happens in the next episode. So we got ourselves. So I will see you guys. Oh, uh, like, subscribe, comment, um, and uh, I'll see you guys next episode. See ya.